Good luck with your cut, Sean. You got this, buddy. Fucking your cut, Sean. You're gonna freaking kill it. Oh, good luck on your cut, Sean. You fucking pussy. Let's get it. Good luck on your cut, Sean. Hey, yo, Sean. Good luck for your cut, bro. You're gonna make it. Welcome to my first episode of Sean's Shreds. I am so dead inside. Oh my days. Last night I stayed up late and it wasn't on purpose because if you saw my Instagram story I said that I was trying to get to sleep before 12. So anyways at 12 I put away my phone and I closed my eyes and um, I couldn't sleep until 3.30 in the morning. And honestly I think it was out of just, I don't know if it was nervousness or excitement for this cut. But look, I forced myself out of bed this morning at 5 to 9. So um, I've been up really like about half an hour I'd say. A lot of you have been wondering who my coach is going to be for the shred and my coach is Gary Pineda. I received my training plan and my food plan this morning, had a look over it and I am excited to start. It's going to be tough, it really will be, especially in the last few weeks but look, we'll push through it and it will be worth it. You can probably tell I am so dead right now but once a bit of caffeine hits me, I'll be flying it. Everything in the meal plan and training plan is so so different to what I'm used to so I can't wait to try it I'll be explaining this all either later in the video or in my next few videos But there is a lot of changes and I'll go through everything with you guys One of the changes is that I have to get 10k steps in every single day and let me show you what I'm used to So I looked over it right and um, my daily total sorry my daily average is 1000 I leave that focus my daily average is 1,655. That is so, so bad, 1,655. I just received my meal plan this morning, so right now I'm gonna go down to my local supermarket and I'm gonna walk down, because as I already mentioned, I'm going for 10K steps a day, so I'm gonna make these small, small changes in my everyday life that'll basically help me get to that goal. I hate walking. Jamie, as you can see by my steps, I'm always cycling or it's getting spins around the place, but sure look, We'll do what we have to do. I have tunnel vision for this cut, honestly. I'll never be more motivated. Although I'm half dead at the moment, I've never been more motivated and driven to get my dream physique. Not even my dream physique, but at the end of the day, I just want to be lean because I have a lot of fat on me. Also, if you lads are shredding, if you're looking to cut, if you're on a diet or whatever, I'll be giving out all my tips. So this series will help you. So yes, I'm half dead, but let's go and get some steps in and get my food. Yeah, I got a gift and a curse. I let shorty give she worth I know one day I gotta leave earth So I gotta give them this word I was already set when they got started They ain't wanna see me at first And I already stuffed about 10 in the 40 So don't make me question Alright lads, so I am now back So far today I have done 6,692 steps I'm actually happy because my daily average is like what? 1,600 And so far it is only It's only 10.30 in the morning and we're nearly done 7,000 steps. After doing all those steps now, I'm hungry. I just got shopping. It's time for my breakfast. All right, um, I just realized that I forgot to buy oats. But thankfully, one of my good friends, he goes to the gym who lives in my state, is giving me 90 grams of oats. Meanwhile, I'll show you lads what I bought. I bought. I don't think I meant to buy them. Oh my days, I bought them by accident. I'm so stupid. I am so stupid. So I got turkey burgers. 5% lean beef mince. Nutri grain bars. 6 pork sausages. 2 packs of that. Almond milk. Bagels. Cocoa pops. And then I just got 3 bottles of flavoured water. But of course these aren't actually all the foods that are on my diet plan. There's way way more. But I just got what I needed for today because I was in a bit of a rush this morning. So I'll get the rest of the stuff tomorrow. Alright lads so my first meal is done. Here we have. 
90 grams of oats, 125 grams of blueberries, and 25 grams of peanut butter. So lads, I finished my first meal and I added up to 720 calories. In that meal, there was 41 protein, 95 carbs, and 22 fat. Right now, I'm drinking my coffee. It's currently 20 to 1. And I have a curfew of my caffeine now. So since I'm cutting, of course, my recovery needs to be key. So I need to get eight hours sleep every single night. And in order for me to get good quality sleep, I need to stop taking caffeine after 4 p.m. every day. So until 4 p.m., I'll be chugging in the coffee. Also, lads, my good friend Gavin, he sent me out the shirt. It's oversized. I absolutely love it. His app will be up on the screen right now if you're interested in getting one. It's a pure leg day essential. And speaking of leg day, today I'll be training legs. So that is, that's my second meal today. I'm not going over the meals really or the macros or anything like that in this video because I'm gonna do a whole full day of eating on my cut. Today is more of an introduction to my shred, what kind of meals I'll be having and what kind of training I'll be doing. But don't worry because soon I'll have a video up purely talking about all my meals and my full diet. So I'm about to have my lunch now and next time I'll see you guys will be, when will it be? It'll be for my pre-workout meal. All right lads, I'm in a rush now. So right here we have a bagel full of stuff, half eat sausage I'll eat that now yeah as I already said I'll go through all my meals in a video soon but this is my pre-workout now I'm about to go and train what's the story Stop. lad I'm listening to fucking Ed Sheeran, Ed Sheeran. caught in 4k listening to Ed Sheeran <laughs> Jesus so lads I'm in Luke's gym right now I absolutely love this place I'll show you why like when you're in here and you're listening to hard style or just sad music that gets you in your fields you have the best session of your life don't you when you're in here and it has a dungeon vibe and you're listening to sad music and shit, we have the best workouts to that. So lads, what's changed about my training is that I'm not really doing like sets of three or four anymore. I've changed to two sets to failure. I'm not used to this kind of training at all, but Gary's really pushing me to my limits today, so hopefully it will all be worth it at the end. Halfway through my workout, and I'm gone. Hardest workout I've ever done in my life. So, lads, done the session now. Absolutely fucked. And I've missed and I've never been so fucked after a training session all my life. My blood sugar my blood sugars, they're going low. It was so intense. Fuck it. 